right, good morning, guys. It's uh, Monday morning. I think today is uh, March 30th. Hope you guys are having a great day. Again, it's Lightning Lawn Care. My name is Mark, coming to you from St. Pete. And uh, we're going to do a review today of the Honda HRX. Uh, been long overdue. I mean to do a review on this, and it's my own personal experience. And uh, got this mower last year. It must have been, I think, around June or so. Again, it's a Honda HRX. It's uh, their top of the line, again, uh, home user uh, mower. Probably seen it at Home Depot or uh, Lowe's. A little bit expensive. I think it's around $599. Um, so, was really hesitant about uh, pulling the trigger on it, but I gotta tell you, this thing's awesome. And you know what, I wanna tell you some of the features here uh, as we go through the review. So let's dive into it. All right, this is it. You guys ever th thought about this Honda HRX? I gotta tell you, don't think again. Don't even think twice. I know it's, uh, I think it retails over at Home Depot or Lowe's, uh, again, about 600 bucks. And uh, I kind of held off on it for a bit, but I got to a point where, again, I wanted to kind of just jump in. Wasn't ready for a commercial mower just yet. Ready for that Z-turn probably next, but this was really a great step up. Again, the Honda HRX uh, 217 comes with 200 cc. Uh, about 187 uh, horsepower on that, which is pretty awesome. Plenty of power, be able to cut through again the tallest grass, uh, and especially be able to give you plenty of power for the self-propelled glide or, or guide that comes with it as well. So uh, some key features, 187 horses on it. Again, be able to cut through some of the deepest grass you got going on. Certainly for a home user, this is key. Uh, and two, got the self-propelled, uh, which is also key as well. Uh, and we'll go through that in just a little bit because the workmanship, the handles, uh, again, real comfortable, saves your hand, especially when you compare it to some of the other mowers. The ergonomics on that self-propelled is spot on. Uh, besides that, uh, some of the other features are on the height adjustment. You've got seven different height adjustments, front and back, and they make it real easy to, again, do the height adjustments. It's just a simple lever, easy to move, easy to change the, the height adjustments on those, both front and back. Uh, I love that, especially coming from a different mower, where, again, it was a lot uh, harder to, again, change the height adjustments, but they made it super easy with this. Overall, the weight of it, uh, it's, it's just like any other mower, I'll be honest with you. It'd be a little bit heavier than some of the other smaller uh, mowers. Uh, but that's because, again, power plant that's in there. Um, what else can I tell you about this? Uh, again, height adjustments, got powerful motor. Let's get to, again, the self-propelled. One of the biggest features of this Honda HRX, uh, and they do this on all of their different particular mowers, is the select drive. Because this is the top line model, they've really kind of added a few extra features with the top line model. One being, again, the adjustment for the control of the speed. Uh, and again, sort of an, a more ergonomic handle and an engage handle here as well. So what is this? Essentially, again, you'll again get the motor ready, rip the cord, start it. And this here engages the motor to move the uh, mower. So this is what gets it going easy to hold on to again you can see the grips they're a nice size they're rounded which is great again perfect for handling whether you want to do it both hands whether again you want to do it a one-handed uh, either way real easy to do and you can select the speed in which you want to mow so again whether you want to set it to the minimum or want to go the slowest speed uh, again a nice leisurely uh, uh, mow or again if you want to pick up the pace a little bit Maybe I'll walk a little faster, I got a longer stride. Uh, maybe I'm a little older, or maybe I walk a little faster. Or again, if I'm, I hate to say, maybe uh, I'm in a little bit of a hurry time crunch, you can set it all the way up here to the max and really get this bad boy moving where when it's set to the max, I'll be honest with you, you're walking pretty briskly 
uh, essentially just keeping up with, again, the mower itself. So, again, with the 187 horses, uh, you can imagine this bad boy moves, cuts clean, the cut is terrific. Uh, and again, it could be easier, again, with the uh, select drive that Honda's added onto this mower. So, this is a huge plus. Uh, my other mower that I had also had was self-propelled. The, the handles itself were real thin, uh, dug into my hands. Uh, didn't have any sort of adjustments, so the speed was whatever it was. Uh, and after a long day, especially when you're hitting multiple lawns, if you weren't wearing gloves, and your hands are tired, you're getting blisters. I gotta tell you, with this year, my hands never got tired, never got blisters, and uh, again, super key feature, without a doubt, it's the Select Drive by Honda. Another key feature that I love about this mower here is the uh, handle adjustments here. It's got three different adjustments that you can do. Uh, easy to, again, adjust the height, whether you be tall, uh, whether maybe you're a little shorter, um, depending on how tall you are, or, um, you can adjust the uh, height adjustments. Simple with a with a click and a click. Really easy. You can see how much lower it went down. Again, maybe somebody who's got maybe longer arms, maybe a little shorter, or again, if you're somebody who's my height, you get somebody who's six foot tall. Easy to. Just clip it right in the spot, and boom, there you go. You notice here too, again, it's got a clip option here, which is great. This green handle changes the setting, whether you want to bag the, uh, the clippings or you want to mulch it. Simple as just pulling that over. I can set it to mulch. I can do it if I want to, half and half, half mulch and half bag, which is a nice feature as well. So if you're looking for a great mulching mower and regular lawnmower, this is it, kind of a two-in-one. As a matter of fact, it comes with a great size bag. Again, real easy to snap right on there. Boom. That's it, you're ready to rock and roll. So, again, I've had this mower for, I'm gonna say probably last six months. I got this back in July. Uh, and haven't had any issues. I've started every single time. Um, again, one rip on the cord there starts it up, whether I'm bagging it, whether I'm mulching it. Uh, again, fuel, just remember, you want to use ethanol free. You know, this is a four stroke, so you got separate gas and separate oil. So make sure you're using uh, the right 1030 or synthetic. And again, want to use ethanol free on your gas. Uh, and this bad boy is going to last a lifetime. So uh, I've been happy without it. I've been happy with this mower. And I hope, uh, again, if you guys are looking for a great home use mower, something a little more power, maybe a little bit of a step up, this is the model to get uh, Honda HRX 217. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Drop a comment, hit the like, and subscribe today. Lightning Lawn Care coming to you from St. Pete, Florida. You guys take care.